it's all said and done, Tank will be a legend yeah. to our kids and us. Yeah. But yeah, uh, uh, face of boxing. One of face. Absolutely. Is, is he getting there? He, I think he is the face right now. He, t- he took Canelo's spot. Uh, uh, what y'all think? Yeah, is is Tank the face of boxing, guys? He's right there, man. You right there. He You're sold right there. out his hometown. That was courtesy of the Porter Podcast, and you heard it yourself. Sean Porter, not he didn't just say Tank Davis is one of the faces of boxing. He said he is the face of boxing, meaning right now, in Sean Porter's eyes, Tank Davis has to thrown Canelo as the face of boxing. And you know who else think he's the face of boxing? Ryan Garcia. And I tell you why. Because Ryan Garcia says, if I beat Tank, I will become the face of boxing, which is telling me he believes Tank Davis is the face of boxing. Maybe it's just me, but I don't even think Javante Davis is close to being the face of boxing. He has to do more than just sell at his hometown. I mean, Canelo is doing Super Bowl commercials. Tank Davis is going to court. And there's no comparison when it comes to resumes. Now, people are going to label me a Javante Davis tank hater. But in reality, I'm a tomato can hater. And when it comes to pay-per-view sales, there's no comparison. You know, Canelo sells out arenas too, but he also got the pay-per-view sales also. Canelo is a cash cow. Javante Davis is a calf. And Javante Davis has nice jewelry. But Canelo has better boxing jewelry than him. Canelo's a legit four-way champion. Also a legit undisputed champion. So when you put that all together, Canelo has the jewelry, the boxing jewelry. He has the image. He's in Super Bowl commercials. And he's the cash cow. His pay-per-view numbers are excellent. Nobody could compete with him in America. And you can't beat the resume. So Tank can't beat Canelo in those four categories because Tank fanboys don't want to believe it, but Canelo is more popular than Tank, more accomplished than Tank. One of these guys is going to the Hall of Fame right now, and that's Canelo Alvarez. Tank is a good fighter. I just think some of these cats got to slow their roll on making him the face of boxing when he's not even close. I mean, maybe his fans in the comment section could convince me, tell me why Tank is a face of boxing over Canelo Alvarez. I just don't see it. To me, he's very talented, but his opposition has been small guys and tomato cans, which he gets outboxed by. But I think part of that is boredom. He knows he's gonna get them later on in the fight and knock them out. Until Tank is challenged by a formidable opponent we we'll never know how good he's going to be. Anyway, what do you think? You agree with Sean Porter? Is Tank Davis the new face of boxing over Canelo Alvarez? I don't think so. He has a lot of work to do. He can start by cleaning out 135. Oh, but leave your thoughts and comments below. JBZ, I'm gone.